Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing very well. So today is something a little different. We all like flying DCS, you like flying DCS, I like flying DCS. Now for me, I'm only interested in flying DCS on multiplayer. I don't think I've ever done single player, I've never done a campaign, I'm just not interested. For me, it's all about flying with other people. It has to be a social hobby, zero interest of just sitting in my hornet learning to use the slams. Now, not all of you are like that, but some are. And for those guys that really want to fly with someone else, which I recommend for everyone, it just makes the experience of flying. 10 times better if you can fly with a buddy and fly in formation and land together and look out for each other and stuff like that. And now we've always wanted a tool that can help you do that. At the moment there are no tools apart from your own ability to make friends, which for a lot of people is just not very easy. DCS we find tends to bring a certain type of personality on board. It's not always going to be easy for that person to find a friend. And I want you to find a friend like my friends, the Grim Reapers, and fly with them. So we've invented a tool. I gave our bunch of brains, we've got a bunch of brains in GR called the Skunk Works, and they do the technical stuff behind the scenes. And one brain in particular, Special K, I've given the task of developing an app that you can use to find a friend, a mate if you like, a bit like uh, if you imagine a, a dating site, to find a friend to fly with in DCS. Say hello Special K and thank you for taking on the task. Hello. Special K has put together Wingman Finder. At the moment as it stands in late July 2020, Wingman Finder is only available in the Grim Reapers Discord. We would like to have it put in other people's discords, in Growling Sidewinders, in EDs. I think it would be fantastic. And if you want that, then contact us, contact me, contact Special K, and we'll get that installed. It's just a Discord app. But for now, it's just in the GR. So the first thing you need to do is come to the GR Discord if you want to try it out. And it's obviously free and available for everyone. You know, we don't want any anything for it. So to show you that, I'm just going to load up any of the modern videos that I've done and show you where, how you can get into our Discord. Now, this video has been released, so let's just go and watch this video. Hello, everyone. Quiet to you. And you can see if you go down here to the video description, show more, you'll see that we have a Discord channel there. You click on that. I'm not going to do it because I'm already in the Discord channel. And it will ask you to download Discord if you don't already have it and bring you through to our channel once in discord and that there is our discord channel you can be in other discord channels like i'm in growling sidewinders and that guys and that guys and that guys and that guys and so on so make sure you've chosen the grim reapers you will have a series of rooms that you can go in these are the rooms that you can see here i'm using a pc but you can use a tablet or a phone or whatever you want now i have a role of a leader you can see me at the top there i'm the leader so i get to see all of the rooms you won't get to see hardly any rooms if you're joining for the first time in fact all you'll get to see i think is welcome here. So go to welcome, make sure you open that up and then go to welcome rules and instructions. You have to do this to be able to see the other rooms in Grim Reaper's Discord. It's there to make sure that you are human and that you're not a robot that's come to destroy our Discord. That does happen. So once you're in rules here, you have to read all of the rules and it's all obvious stuff like don't bring your pawn in and stuff like that. Okay. Once you've read through all of that, you must follow out the instructions that are in number 18 here. If you have read, understood and agree with all those rules, then please go to bot commands, which you will be able to see and type in question mark rank followers. If you don't do that, you don't get to see inside our discord rooms so the next thing for you to do is go to bot commands you will be able to see that and you can see all these guys that are doing it about eight and a half thousand at the moment type in what they've all typed in question mark rank space followers you will be then given access to our discord at a relatively low level but enough to use wingman finder next you will scroll down to the public access area now you won't have to have as much to worry about this is all our private stuff that the full-time members see but the area you will be looking for is this here dcs public lobby make sure you've opened that up so you can see all of the rooms here you've got various stuff that you can do you can look at public announcements you can look at eagle dynamic news you can look at public lobby text and media and equipment and stuff and one of them is wingman finder let's click on wingman finder we're now in wingman finder on the gr server sorry that took so long but it just some people need helping if they're not used to discord so i'm in wingman finder now i'm going to scroll down to the bottom i'm going to type in and you must do this too exclamation mark subscribe okay i'm going to talk you through the process of signing up it says at that point hi cap i've sent you a direct message dm to keep this conversation private this is what it looks like in a pc it will look roughly the same in whatever media you're using at the top left i get my dms i've got one from wingman finder one from 104th bullet 
but I'm from Bean, so I'm going to click on Wingman Finder. We're now in the direct message system with GR Wingman Finder. Welcome GR Cap. Thank you for subscribing to GR's Wingman Finder. This service helps to connect you and to other DCS players with similar interests. Due to legal requirements in some countries, you must be at least 18 years old. Nothing I can do about that. That's just the law. If I'm going to, you know, start pairing people up, years to, to use this service. To unsubscribe at any time, use the that command there, and it will just leave you alone and never touch you again until you resubscribe. So, do you want to continue? Yes. Next question, and we've just got a series of questions. It has to learn about us, what we want to do, what we want to fly, who we want to know, and so on, before it can start pairing us up. So. Very good. I'm now going to ask you some questions to get you know you better. All answers will be stored securely and will be solely used to find your perfect match. It will only take some minutes and you are good to go. So first question, your two letter ISO code of your country. Well, I come from Great Britain. If you don't know what your ISO code is, then just Google it or whatever uh, other uh, search engines are available. GB, uh, how old are you? I'm unfortunately getting older. I'm that one, 35 to 50. So I press two. Next, if you don't speak English, press Y to have your wingman speak your language. Otherwise, press no. So I do speak English, so I'm going to press no. I don't need a special language consideration. Which kind of in-game communication do you prefer? No preference, Discord, SRS, or TeamSpeak? Um, I use all of them. I use them for missions, that for armor, and that just for general asking about. So no preference, I don't mind. Which kind of missions do you prefer? No preference, cast, cap, or seed? I'm happy to do all, to be honest. So for me, I'm going to do no preference. The more no preferences we put, the more likely that we're going to be paired up. The more specific we do, the less likely that we're going to find a pair, obviously. Would you be willing to teach? Well, for most people, I guess that would be no. But for me, I do teach professionally now in DTS, so I guess yes. How many hours per week do you play DCS on average? Well, for me, it's going to be 14 plus, so three. Would you like to be found by the quick match solution? Yes, I would. Any solutions you can offer me, I'll be happy with. So yes, quick match. And is there anything at this point, Kay, you want to mention about quick death, ma uh, death match, quick match? <laughs> yeah, um, so a quick match uh, is uh, the normal, normal uh, wingman finder matches everybody who is matching himself. So if you if you do a match to another people or another guy and the other guy matches you, then you have a correct match. It's like a well-known uh, dating solution, more or less. Yeah. If you use wing, or if you use quick match. Um, you will get presented a match directly without the other one matching you up front. So it's for, let's say, you, you need a buddy now uh, to play with tonight. Mm -hmm. Not to have him as a, as a wingman for, let's say, for life, uh, but just for tonight. You need a Ryo, for instance. Yep. You need uh, a pilot for the F-14. You need a teacher for uh, AAR. Um, then you will use uh, usually quick match for that specific task and for for let's say the the more uh, uh, or let's say for for uh, if you, if you need somebody um, for longer to to play with to have more fun with um, then you usually use the normal match Roger so quick match one night stand and the other one the main one is for getting married Roger okay. Uh, on which days would you like to fly? Well, I have a mission on Monday, so I don't want that. Tuesday's good. Mission on Wednesday, don't like that. Thursday's good. Friday's okay. And let's take uh, Sunday. Okay. Uh, on weekdays, what would you, your preferred time to fly? Note this is local time, so don't worry about GMT conversions, UTC, Zulu or anything. Just your local time, whatever your local time is. Wingman Finder will sort all the, the conversions out. Uh, well, on a weekday, it's going to be, I work in the daytime, so it's going to be evening, going to be that one there only, uh, from 1800 local to 2200 local, okay. Same question, but on weekends, uh, I got a bit more time, so I can fly in the day and in the evening, okay. Please describe your special skills, multiple, multiple skills can be selected, so I enjoy doing air to air refueling, I sort of enjoy carry ops, slash and don't enjoy air to air, BVR, air to air, ACM, and air to ground. I like all of them. I'll do all of them. Okay. Which assets do you own? I own Persian Gulf. I own Entity R. I own Normandy. I own Channel. I own Syria, which is coming out obviously very soon. So I'll put that one up. Super Carrier. 
uh, own everything. And again, I guess the more you put down here, the more likely I'm going to find a match. Let's go. Uh, describe yourself briefly so that your wingman can assess you better. Um, I'm going to type something in now. Can you explain roughly the reason that I'm typing in this and how, how that bit works? Yeah, so uh, all other aspects are more or less, uh, well, um, not subjective, but objective. So four hours flight time or flying on Mondays, um, uh, that is that is very objective. But you would, if you would like to search a wingman, you will you will need some subjective information about him just to see does that fit, um, who is that buddy. And so we, we added a, a solution which is not just clicking, but uh, typing in and uh, saying something about yourself. Want to do that? Boom, get that in there. For which planes uh, do you need to search a wingman for? You need to enter at least one plane. So multiple planes separated by a comma. If you search somebody to play combined arms, you want, you want CA. So this is, an, this is a semi-intelligent system. You can spell the plane however you like. So if I type... Uh, F14, that will be close enough, it will pick it up. And should I try Bogachev? Do you reckon it will pick up Bogachev? Bogachev Mobile, it may or may not. Mobile. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bogachev Mobile, that's going to give it a go. Okay, so I think it's understood that an F14 and an F18. How many hours have you been playing? Yes, it's picked it up. How many hours have you been playing the F18 module? Um, load 1 to 250. Uh, go. How many hours have you been playing the F-14 module? Uh, not so many, 0 to 50. Uh, in the F-14, do you want to fly as the pilot or as the jester? I want to fly as the pilot. No, I'm going to use the jester because I'm just going to find it harder to get a match otherwise. Um, I don't know. What do you, can I do both out of interest? Or does it have to be one? Uh, no, you have, to, you have to select one. I like being a That's just your, just your preference. Okay. Just your preference. Um, it's... Uh, I think more and more of interest for the quick match solution, to be honest. Um, yeah. But uh, just for, for now, say whatever you do most. Watch up. Okay. Uh, okay. Your data will now be put into your matchmaker to find a list of possible wingmen for you. Your anonymized profile can be found with others uh, until you unsubscribe. At that point, it deletes all of your data and stuff, doesn't it? It just gets rid of everything. Right. Yeah. Please say yes if you're happy to go ahead. Yes, I am. Incredibly happy, Mr. Wingman Finder. Right, next thing is it's saying you, thank you, you've successfully subscribed to Wingman Finder. You can view your profile here by pressing it by typing that, which we will do in a minute. To find possible wingmen, you have to execute the match command. Uh, and if we want any help to see what we can do, we've got help subscription, help matchmaker. So let's do that now just to see what we can do. So, regards our subscription, help subscription. Here's things that we can do to with regards to subscription. We can subscribe, which we've already done. We can unsubscribe, or we can do our V-card. Let's go and have a look at our V-card. So, V-card. Ping. That is our uh, virtual card. Is that what it stands for? It's just all of our, our collated data, isn't it? Yeah, that's your profile, more or less. And that is what people will see, but they will see it in an anonymous way. We will see it in the matching uh, in a minute, but um, that is just for you. And if you have a match, then the the uh, other body will see exactly that. One question people are going to ask are, if I've now got the JF-17, how can I go and edit that? So you just say subscribe again. Right. And right. if you say subscribe again, you have to go through the whole process, unfortunately. Yeah. So you can't just uh, okay. change one single thing at that time. Uh, but uh, you can you can update. So if you, for instance, uh, get older sometime or if mm -hmm. uh, you add modules or, or planes, um, you can change that. At Roger. Well, I can't be bothered to do that now, but that's fine so people know. Right, so the next thing I'd like to do is look at my matchmaker things I can type in. So help, help matchmaker. Right, things we can do. We can do our match. We can do a quick match. We can do show matches. We can do delete matches. And we can do rematch. So should we do match first of all? Yes. Right, so this is finding my long-term wife. Match. Go. Right, uh, it's come up with... You're going to have to talk me... Through this, so it's come up with someone else who's got a uh, Bogachev mobile. I see. Their location is England. They have no preference. They can teach. Uh, is this me? Is this my vehicle? No. This is someone else. Oh, 
Uh, that's somebody else, yeah? Right, so they've got 14% yeah. So if you mentioned yourself, that would be yeah. a bit ridiculous then. Roger, so they've, well, I've like, literally found my future partner, I think. Discord, they prefer. Yes, I can teach. They have modules F18. They have assets, uh, NTT, no, uh, what's Palm Tree? Persian Golf and Super Carrot. They have a whole bunch of lead skills. They fly Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday and Sunday at a whole, no wonder I got a match at all these different times. Okay, what do I do now and what can I do now? So you can either say it matches or it doesn't match. So if you if you click the check mark, then you say, well, that buddy would fit to me. Mm -hmm. And if you say across, uh, he will just throw it away. Roger. Oh, and he's, oh, he's, he's writing here as well. If I'm on your six, something must have gone horribly wrong. I don't like the guy's attitude. It like, sounds like goddamn sea donkey. I don't like him. Okay, I want to get rid of him. Can I get rid of him? Yeah. If I get rid of press. him, do I know there'll be more? How do I know how many there are? Uh, you currently don't see, so you get a maximum of 10. But you go through the process, and if you, can't, if you don't get anybody presented anymore, um, then the matchmaking is finished. Otherwise, if you just wait for five minutes, it's finished too. Right, I'm... And you can do Roger, I'm crossing okay. Sea Donkey off because I don't like him. This, uh, this is more my person. I'm awesome. Perfect attitude to have. Age 35 to 50, that's me all over. Uh, Norway? Who's this? This must be... Oh, who's from Norway? We do have a Norway agent, but I've forgotten who it is. No preference. DCS, comms. Yeah, he's got F18, F16, A10, AGS, ME109, F5. This guy is my guy. Isn't this interesting? We could even make a game about who this is. I can't remember who our new one's on tail. It's someone else. Assets. Uh, Persian Gulf, uh, Normandy, uh, that thing there. Bunch of stuff there. Days, Wednesday, 18 to 22. Weekends, Saturday, Sunday. I like him. I like him. Can I search for other guy, other other V cards with before I accept, or do I have to accept now? Um, yeah, you can go uh, right or left on the um, button you see right or yep. left. Just press the the, um, uh, the arrows right. and it will switch through. Right, I've seen all that, but I like my man, so I'm going to go with him. Okay, uh, where's my Norwegian? There he is. I like my Norwegian. I'm going to tick him. Shall I tick him? Yeah, why not? Ticks. Okay. Um, that's it. So I've selected him. What happens next? Now you have to wait until these guys accept you too. Right. So, and so the one not... this will be another video then. So, I, so first of all, I could accept a whole bunch of people, I'm guessing. Yeah, you can accept as many as you get presented, more or less. So in the in the beginning, you get 10. And yeah. if other people subscribe to the solution, yeah. uh, you get presented more people. So calling match uh, at regularly yeah, would be mm -hmm. would make much sense uh, just to see if, if new people arrive uh, with whom you would like right. to match. Okay, well, I can't show the next step at the moment, valued viewers, because I've got to wait for that Norwegian now to read. So presumably we now would have sent him a message with my details and he's got to say yes or no. And if he says yes, something will then come back to me. But that will have to be in a separate video because that could be days or weeks because I don't know. I don't know even who the guy is in real life. So we'll have to see. Uh, very interesting. Anything at this point? Uh, should we quickly go through the uh, we've got some other commands here? Quick match. We've got show matches. We've got delete matches and we've got rematch. Do you want to just have a talk? Yeah, about you, can, you can call the quick match solution. Why not? Just try. Okay, quick match solution. Please answer some short questions that I can find your perfect buddy. Okay, uh, what are you looking for? I'm looking for a wingman uh, of the planes that I've got. I'm looking for an F-18. If I can get him, there he is. Um, I want to do, I don't mind, I'll do any mission. Uh, and it's literally just come up with, a, <laughs> this one's come up with Talon. So this is Talon, yeah. this is coming up with that. Uh, would you like to chat with them to organize a meeting? Uh, why not? And I've asked, you can now chat with Talon. Channel can be closed by typing or after five minutes of inactivity. Right. So at that point, I literally just messaged Talon, do I? Yeah. So uh, we had to implement a solution which is uh, more or less peeping through Discord. So um, if people come from other Discords, for instance, you mm -hmm. can't easily chat with them. Mm -hmm. And therefore, Wingman Finder is acting as a kind of proxy. So uh, you open up a channel then with Talon. Talon will get a private message mm -hmm. from the Wingman Finder mm -hmm. um, saying, hello, Cap is uh, trying to chat with you. And right. then you can just chat through Wingman Finder uh, with that solution. That was a workaround, more or less, uh, to, to work around that, that issue with Discord. Um, but you still can, um, for instance, search him as a friend. Yeah, yeah. 
add a message friend, and so on. So I could copy that, I could go to start a conversation, I could type Talon with his tag number, boom, and then obviously I've been talking to him and I probably shouldn't be showing that, but you get the idea there. There we go. I think one, one thing to mention, and that is what you've seen with the, with the quick match solution, and mm -hmm. people will have to think about if they say yes or no to the quick match solution. You see, you don't have to wait for Talon to match yourself. Yeah. You just... get directly his his right. V card. So that's the that idea. is okay. That's yep, the idea sorry. of quick match. That's the idea of quick match. You can just say, "Hey, do you yes. want to go and fly now?" Yeah, yeah, but if if somebody is very very keen with this profile and would like to say, "Oh, I just want to to wait until the other one," and so on, then it's it's better to have uh, the quick match disabled. Uh, I find it a very nice solution because, as said, it's uh, that you you usually search somebody for a one night stand in DCS. To be honest, yeah, yeah just to to show you something or to fly with you at the e that evening. And therefore, that solution is, is quite nice and it would be good for people to say yes here. Um, okay, welcome back. I've just noticed I've had a couple of DMs from Wingman Binder. Let's go and have a look. Ping. They're just to say, oh, okay, this is unexpected. Matchmaking finished. Please use Match regularly to see if you have new proposals. Uh, connection with Talon's closed. That's just because it timed out because I was just away for a few minutes. So uh, this is later on that day and we're pretty sure the new Norwegian guy has replied to me um so should we do a match and, and check uh say show matches show exclamation matches. mark show matches. let me just check there show matches right roger ah i see show space matches no no underscore underscore sorry you have to it's one word every every command has to be one word roger show underscore matches right uh what we've got to finish your match you can send it was viking I thought it was. You can send Viking a friend request. When they are online, you can press that there to start a quick chat with them. Right. So is this? So I've got this come back because Viking, the Norwegian, has accepted me. Is that right? Yeah, I think he's uh, Iceland. Should it be not Norwegian? But well, Iceland. maybe he's. Oh yeah, I get confused. Right, he is. He is. I know who he is. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, right. Okay. Should I try clicking on that envelope? I don't think he's online, but should I try anyway? Uh, you can. You can try if he's online. Otherwise, um, right. you uh, see just the same as if it would be a quick match. So, oh, um, yeah, gotcha. If, if you do show matches, it will show all your matches, which are uh, where you have matched uh, the buddy and uh, he has matched you. So when that happens, it will automatically be added to that uh, to your matches. And you see all your matches with show matches. A Roger, and I can cycle. And you won't see the quick matches. So quick match is just a one-shot solution, no marriage at all. Yeah, mm -hmm. if you marry, you will see him in show matches. Okay, and then I can go and contact this guy with his uh, details. There. Yeah. Lovely job. Yeah. Right. Anything else you want to say, Kay? Um, if you like to delete your matches or do a, let's say, a rematch, do everything again. You can say delete matches, for instance, and say rematch which will do delete matches and match in one step or you can do it uh, step by step if you say just delete matches and the match command again yeah that is just yeah if if you would like to right. do that or got right. get rid of everything and reset then you can do that so if you made an error you can just go rematch and it will start from the scratch essentially yeah, yeah I see that. and if you unsubscribe for sure everything is deleted from our database so um the data is stored anonymously as already said so we just see a bunch of numbers, <clears throat> no names, unless you put them in. And um, so it's uh, it's just deleted and all matches are deleted. So nobody else will see you, even if he had matched with you, um, if you do an unsubscribe. Lovely job. Right. Uh, thank you for that, Kay. I insist that everyone comes in and uh, tries out the wingman fighter and tries to find a friend. Uh, I hope that was useful and see you later.